hi guys, my name is Izzy. I'm a sporadic YouTuber. I just pulled something in my neck. Ouch. Um, and today I'm going to be doing my November wrap up. So without further ado, let's just get into it. So there are a few books that I don't have with me because I rented it from the library and um, I'm going to use this as a placeholder. Um, I rented both of uh, Chimada Ngozi Adiche. Is that how you say her name? I rented both of her little short books from the library. Um, we Should All Be Feminists, uh, I read. And I'm, I have started this one and then I ended up buying my own copy. I also read the first two issues of March and I'm currently reading the third one. Um, these are really really good by the way. I heard about them over on Riley's channel and they're just great. They're, um, they're a graphic novel about the civil rights movement and um, John Lewis, his involvement in the civil rights movement. So the other four books that I've read, I read Turtles All the Way Down by John Green. <sighs> I absolutely loved this. As you can tell from the, all the tabs, this was amazing and I just, mm, it was really good. It's an actual portrait of mental health and there were some little things that like I, I want to tell you guys about but I don't want to give you spoilers. The next book that I picked up was A Little Something Different by Sandy Hall. This was amazing. I love this. Okay, so I am not a super huge romance reader. I don't read a lot of romance, but this one was perfect. So this is about a love story between two people and it's just told from all these different perspectives except for the couple. Like it's told from everybody else's perspective except for those two people, their perspective of their relationship, which just makes it so much more brilliant. Like there is one perspective that's told from like a bench that's obsessed with butts. There is a perspective that is told from a freaking squirrel. I love this. And it had an array of diverse characters, which I did not expect. There is LGBT representation in here. There is different um, races represented in here. There is a plethora of diversity in this book. Um, there is disability diversity mentioned in this. It's great. This is really fucking brilliant and I, I loved it. I gave it five stars. So the next book that I ended up reading was The Upside of Unrequited by Becky Abitali. Again, I really, really, really enjoyed this. I think I gave it four or five out of five stars. I can't remember. I think it was four. Um, but I loved this. There's a plethora of diverse characters once again. Oh, speaking of Becky Abitali, have you guys seen the Love, Simon trailer? I bawled. I'm so excited for it. If you have not read Simon vs. a Homo Sapiens Agenda, you need to get on it. It. You need to read it. You need to get excited because the movie's going to be brilliant. Oh, I'm so ready. The last book that I've read this past month is Violent Ends by um, a whole bunch of people. <laughs> 17 different authors. So here's the deal. When I read this, I thought it was one author to telling multiple perspectives because I think it's because I read something a little different and it kind of got me in that mindset. Um, but no, this is actually an anthology, which I didn't realize. And Neil Schusterman, who wrote which you guys know I loved, um, writes one of the writes one of the perspectives in here. You guys, he writes a story that's told from the perspective of the gun. That was probably not the right motion to do. That was probably really insensitive considering this is centered around a school shooting. That was a little insensitive. Sorry. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I really enjoyed this as well. It was very interesting to see like all these different perspectives. I think I only ended up giving it four stars because there were a couple, because it was an anthology of one event, I felt like there were a couple like loose ends that were never tied up. Um, but I really did enjoy it. The um, perspective of the sister as well, like the sister of the shooter. She had me weeping like a little freaking baby. I I was a mess. I was a mess. Um, but some of the perspectives are a little eh. But um, yeah, I really enjoyed this quite a bit. Um, yeah, this was really interesting. So I also did start Renegades. I was supposed to read this for Tome Topple, but I kind of failed. Um, I'm like a quarter of the way in. This has really been good, by the way. I do plan on finishing this first thing. Um, but yeah. Uh, I'm, I have been enjoying this. <laughs> That's it. Those are the books I have read this past month. So anyway, peace. I'm out. Goodbye, guys. I love you. Bye.